Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing and subscribing. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tale reading. In this reading, we're going to find out the person on your mind, what do they secretly want to say to you but isn't saying it. Today is the 26th of April 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 2.37 p.m. Let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. Person on Virgo's mind right now. What do they secretly want to say to Virgo but isn't saying it? Now think about the person you like to know, Virgo. And please also bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and your person. Wow. Eight of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, Virgo, I see two different versions here. The first version would be if the person in your mind is somebody you're separated from. And the second version would be if this is someone you're currently, you know, uh, dating or in a relationship with. If there's no separation yet, okay? So we've got the four swords right here. So the person in your mind has been thinking a lot about you. They secretly may want to say to you, if both of you are separated, that they're still in so much pain. They're still so hurt because of the separation. Two of cups in one verse. They can't bear being away from you, being apart from you, but they're trying to maintain their calm, as calm as possible. Because the four swords is like laying down, just kind of, kind of like wishing and hoping and as you can see just calmly laying down there right but if they secretly may also want to say to you if they've been acting as though they are calm or that they're not doing anything about the separation or not talking to you after or since the separation it doesn't mean that they're not in pain it doesn't mean that they are still feeling very hurtful okay still feeling very hurt we've got the justice here so they may also secretly want to say to you that you, they want to do right by you and through your cups that they would like to see you or see you again um, or be reunited with you, okay? The world here, they could secretly also want to say to you that if they have a choice, if they had a choice, they would want to uh, start a new chapter with you, with the lovers. Lovers indicates a choice. That would be their choice if they could. And you know, Virgo, I always talk about how it takes two hands to clap, whether it's you or your person. But you know, e even if one person says, this is my choice, I want to be with you, but the other person doesn't reciprocate, then it's no deal, right? So we've got the Ten of Pentacles here in my verse and the Emperor in my verse. They may secretly want to say to you also that uh, maybe their friends or close friends or family do not agree do, or do not like your connection either. Do, they do not agree with the separation or that they do not like both of you being together. Okay, this part is very specific and it's for some of you. They may also secretly want to say to you that they've been putting their head down, trying to focus on their work. Okay. They don't feel feel great right now because the emperor is in reverse. That means they feel like, you know, um, they're out of control of this situation, of this separation. It's almost like I cannot do anything about this right now, yet, as of yet. Um, maybe it has something to do with their situation, like family or um, could be their own family if they are married, if not could be just about, you know, their mom, dad, siblings, whatever that's going on, or their business as well. This part is, uh, again, very, very specific. It's not for all of you. Now, Virgo, if this is someone you're not separated from, the person on your mind, um, they secretly may want to say to you that the justice, that they're hoping that both of you would actually mm, get into like to make things official or that they're thinking about it, okay? This is about thoughts. They're thinking about making things official through your cups, maybe making things official 
online or to tell to talk about you to tell people uh, people they're close with about you but the three of swords and the non non action here four swords could also mean that they secretly want to say to you that they still are kind of hurt from the past because of something from the, their past that they may I feel like they could be afraid that it could cause issues between the two of you two of cups in reverse they may also especially if this is someone quite new they still haven't gotten over maybe someone from their past yet they maybe they want to secretly tell you that they're not completely over something that has happened to them in the past or not completely over an ex okay so but um, Virgo if this is true then let them be okay because the lovers is right here that means again it takes two hands to clap you can't force things if they choose you they choose to be with you then great if they don't then it is what it is okay you can't force anybody to love you and we've got the star in my verse and the page of cups this reminded me of my ex of eight years um i left him but he was really trying to force it to you know like get back together or like uh, made me feel bad made me feel guilty guilt tripping me and all of that it's not gonna work never gonna work it just pushed me away he just kept pushing me away um harder and harder each time each time when he acts like that so but bear that in mind virgo if that's you um who knows who knows it could go vice versa as well the stars and what verse and then we've got the page of cups sorry virgo like uh, i think i mentioned this already but something my left ear is actually ruptured <laughs> because of years of flying traveling uh, flying on a plane because my ear has always been sensitive with the pressure so i just checked yesterday and um yeah the doctor saw that there's a rupture so i can't hear very well like it's muffled it'll take like eight weeks four to eight weeks to to heal so but this is why i'm like talking a bit weird right now i don't know if you know i'm talking too loud or too soft or you can hear like some echoing as well Ugh, it's so annoying but anyway virgo please bear with me okay i've got the page of cups right here Hmm. Let's pull out some few more cards. Let's see a bit more here for a go. All right. So the person in your mind secretly wants to tell you that they are still interested with Knight of Wands, still passionate about you. Yeah, look, we've also got the King of Wands here, Eight of Swords, and a Verse. They still want to talk to you, Page of Cups. If you're separated, they want to still they want to talk to you but they're still in pain yeah they secretly may want to tell tell you that they're sorry or that they're still in pain they haven't gotten over you yet but if this is someone relatively new i would say that they are interested in you they secretly want to tell you that they find you to be someone very kind very compassionate soft soft as in soft-hearted like good-hearted okay you could be there are many people I've encountered on the outside look very tough, but on the inside, they are just like marshmallows. Perhaps that's you, Virgo. But I'm just a little bit concerned about this Three of Swords right here. If this is someone relatively new, they may not have completely healed yet from their past. And they may also want to tell you that, you know, they've worked really, really hard to be where they are at right now. Perhaps they don't want to get hurt again. If this is someone new but i do sense them uh wanting something serious with you with the justice secretly may want to tell you that they're working on themselves they're working towards you know um healing 
they could also be going through something else, okay, that they could be trying to heal it, to heal from. May not be an ex, could be something else. They secretly also may want to say to you that you are definitely worth it, worth the time. And they would like to invest in you and then the world right here to start a new chapter with you, to be with you, to be reunited with you. And also this could be for some of you in a long distance relationship. They secretly may want to say to you that they're working towards coming to see you or bringing you over to go see them, okay, to be reunited. All right, Virgo, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And a lot of you I've seen on my analytics, you've been watching my videos um, all the time, every day but then you don't subscribe. If you've watched so many times and you find value in this, in all the readings, don't forget to subscribe, okay? And also uh, hit on the bell notification button so you'll be notified every time when I post your videos. And for those of you who do not know, I do have a main channel, it's called Chelsea Love Tarot. I usually do 12 individual sign readings over there and also I would go live. So subscribe to my main channel as well, Chelsea Love Tarot and um, and my travel vlog channel. <laughs> All right, take care, Virgo. I hope to see you back here again soon. Love you. Bye.